this video, I will be explaining how to solve a univariate optimization problem. This is obviously an application of calculus. The problem is say that corporate profits before taxes in billions of dollars can be approximated by this equation that you can see here in the screen. The profit respect to x equals 17x squared minus 306x plus 2324 where x equal 1 correspond to the year 2001. So that means that this x is in years. And the profit is telling me here that it's in billions of dollars. And we need to find the maximum profit during the years 2001 to 2016 inclusive. So we include the years 2001 and the year 2016. So this is a problem of finding the maximum profit. So it's an optimization problem. So for getting a solution of a problem like this, obviously the first thing we need to do is compute the derivative of this. So let's compute the derivative of this. And I know that this is a polynomial, so the derivative exists for sure in any point. So the critical values will be the points when the derivative is equal to zero. So compute the derivative and make this derivative equal to zero. And after you do that, try to solve this equation for x. So find the value of x that makes zero this equation. So let's see. The derivative of the profit it will be then here we have these two as exponent multiplying by 17. So that is 34. And we reduce the exponent in 1, so we get 34x the derivative of this term. The derivative of this term is 306. This is x to the power 1. The 1 multiply this, you have negative 306. And, the, and you reduce the exponent in 1, so you get x to the power 0. So this is 1. So it will be minus 306. And finally, the derivative of the last term, but this is a constant, the derivative is 0. So we get the derivative. And after we get the derivative, made this derivative equal zero and solve the equation for x and obviously this is an easy equation 34x equal 306 moving this to the other side and dividing now by 34 you get that x equal 306 over 34 so this is the value of x 306 over 34 you can use a calculator and you will notice that this is 9 eh? so let's type here 9 so we have that this is 9. So 9 is a critical value. Here the derivative is 0. But we need to find the maximum of the profit. And this is a possible maximum, so we don't know. So and they need to be in this interval. So in the interval from 2001 to 2016. But notice that this one, this, this 2001 is actually number 1. So we are working in this interval the interval 1 16. There are three possible values for the maximum. Now I'm using the extreme value theorem that say that the maximum must be in the extreme of the interval or maybe a critical value. So we have a critical value and we have number 1 and number 16 that are the boundary of the interval. They are possible maximums. This 9 is also a possible maximum. The only that we need to do is compute the value of the profit at that point, at 1, at 16, and number 9. So let's do it. So we compute the profit in these three values. Profit of 1, the profit of 16, or the profit when the year is 2009. So it will be P of 9. So let's compute the first one, P of 1. P of 1, what we need to do is go to the original equation that defines the profit and substitute x by 1. So it will be 17 one, multiplied by 1 to the power 2 minus 306 multiplied by 1 plus 2324. So let's type it in here. And if you do that, you get that this is, so use your calculator obviously, it's, this is 17, this is 306 plus 2324. I got 2035. Let's see what happened if we do the same but now when x equals 16. If x equals 16, then let's compute the profit when x equals 16. Just make a substitution x by 16. 
If you do that, you get the same equation, but now instead of x, you type 16. Use your calculator, 17 times 16 squared minus 306, etc. And get the answer. My, the answer that I get here is 1,780. So now I noticed that the property was bigger in 2001 than in 2016. This is 2,035 billions of dollars was the profit in 2001. The profit in 2016 was 1,780. So let's compute the profit in the critical value, x equal nine. So we're gonna say that the profit at nine will be again substituting x by nine. You get this, use your calculator and you will notice that the answer is 947 billion of dollars in this case. Yeah? So that's what you have now. So you can compare what is the maximum. So now you know that the, in this interval, the profit is, the maximum profit was 2,035 billions of dollars. And actually the critical value was a minimum. So the minimum of this was 947 billion of dollars was the minimum profit and that appears in the critical value. Because the question was finding the maximum profit in this interval, then I'm going to answer that the maximum profit was 2,035 billion of dollars, and that happened in 2001. And this is an application of the extreme value theorem. The maximum or the minimum will be a boundary of the close interval or one critical value. With this, I finish my explanation. I hope you have found it useful. Thank you.